Welcome to DB Overland. I am John. This weekend we are redeeming ourselves. We are going to tackle the Polecat Bend Trail again. Uh, last time we got shut down just because the weather just went way south on us. Uh, we had like 20 below zero. The snow just started getting absolutely terrible, the drive-in, so we were not able to finish it out. So. We are going to redeem ourselves this weekend and we're going to refinish it. But the only problem is this weekend, yeah, the weather is slightly better. We got nothing but forecast for rain today. I think tomorrow is going to be a little bit better. Um, you can already kind of see the trails flooded out. <laughs> so it's going to be a greasy, nasty trail trip this, uh, this weekend, but it should be a lot of fun. Little bit, yeah. We didn't have rocks last time. range working.
Well, we stopped again in this uh, nice little ravine. Uh, not as much snow as last time. The climb up should be pretty good. Now, the last time I was out here, I mentioned uh, a coal vein underneath these rocks. And so this time we decided to uh, gather some up for the fire tonight. Let's see, uh, BJ's working on that right now. Coming out pretty easy, isn't it? Oh yeah, that top layer's super soft. You want to just let it drop and then we can gather it down below or? Well, I'll just see if I can get bigger chunks. Oh, okay. That's the thing is most of this is so compressed. Let's see what I can do if I can chisel. Yeah, the powder won't work as well, right? Uh-uh. Okay. I don't believe. I, I have never burnt, really burnt coal. Neither have I. My original house as a kid, man, had coal in it. But yeah. We never used it. Let's see. Coming so what now. about up like this stuff's pretty. Ooh, there you go. Oh, yeah. There you go. I'll just get him behind it. Even sweet pea wants some. <laughs> Oops, sorry, yeah, surface. Hey, what about, what about down here where it's a little bit more open? See, like right here? See how it's not quite as big? Yeah, I might take the bottom layer off. Yeah. Oh, come in from down below. Like, oh. Like this. Hey, there we go. Come down here and. There's a bunch of it. Sure. Yeah. Oh. 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 Cause I can get that to move, you know? Dang it, I'm gonna do Oh, that one I was getting to move pretty good. Oh yeah, look at that. Now this is this is what mud. This is probably mud that yes. layer of mud. Yeah, because they say stone up above and yeah, the mud down below. Clay down below, clayish mud. Because they that what coal is compacted uh, vegetation. Is that what that is? Where coal is? Yeah, we had our dinosaur. Yeah, it's. Okay. I mean, isn't that what we. Oh, Our petrol's off of that, right? Yeah, oil's off of uh, decomposed uh, vegetation. Yeah, I can see right here we got a lot of vegetation up in there. Yeah, we do. On that top layer. Oh, it'll burn. All of it'll burn. <laughs> we'll make it look like a rock. Yeah getting deeper. There you go. There you go. Getting thicker. Uh, rock. Yeah. I don't know. All we do is give it a shot. Yeah. It burns it in. Dropping a whole bunch down here. Yeah, they say you don't need a lot of it. Yeah. Well, we want a nice hot fire tonight because it's cold out. <laughs> Driver's side, BJ. There you go. Stay, stay driver though. 
Guy turn driver a little bit. Yeah, right there. Like that. Hold on. Oh, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I didn't like it. Keep going like that, BJ. Yeah.
I think I'm gonna straddle the ravine. Oh, you had like a half an inch on your rear drive line. enough stay stay it ain't no river wide enough oh, yeah. ain't no mountain high enough <laughs> All right. I like singing music man oh we're good yeah it's it kind of filled in a little bit right here I mean compared to what we just came down yeah nah dude I think we're okay this we're isn't as bad as I thought it's only a bunch of holes. <laughs> Pipe will catch us from rolling. Yeah. Yeah. No, I think we're good, man. I think so. As long as we catch that driver and passenger tire on that that rock right there. Yeah. Go ba dunk dunk. Yep. I think we'll be good. Oh yeah. Okay.
poured in my window. You got to stop or are you good to keep rolling, BJ? Oh, uh, we're good to keep rolling for a little bit. So we were cruising along. Uh, I was uh, about third gear low range, just trying to make up some time because we are not doing good for time today. These uh, mud holes and whatnot, it's, things are really washed out. So uh, the road's been a lot more choppier, but we were cruising along and uh, BJ hollers over the radio, tire, tire, tire. And um, yeah, looks like my bumper has failed. Fun. <laughs> so now the plan is me and BJ is gonna try to. Oh god! And it's this. This is what I mean. It's it's like this everywhere. It's nasty, and I parked in it. <laughs> but but it, it sheared that off. I didn't weld that. It came on the truck. But we're gonna get this off, and we're gonna put it on the back of BJ's uh, Jeep. And because that would probably be the easiest thing to do. Easiest man. Easiest thing to do. Yeah, we can tuck it right in there. Yep. So, okay. You want to just record us trying to do this? I can't see it. Okay. Oh my gosh. That was. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> no, that was actually a good spot to have it happen. Yeah, luckily it didn't get any worse. Ooh. In here. You need it, Ooh, I don't know. Eh. There's two different holes that I put in it. Okay, so. I was gonna say we're gonna have to slide out. Yeah. At this point. <sighs> If I can get it to slide out. It's a lot easier when you don't have the stinking tire on there. Yeah, you wanna let's see where are we at. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to slide out because I'm about all the way in. Okay. So, Alright, here, if I lift up on this, see if you can get it. Oh, hold up, let's see. All right, I'm in. in. I'm in. Oh, beauty. I'm in. Beauty. Got a pinner. Got a pinner. Pinner to winner. There we are. Oh my gosh. <laughs> hey, look at the clearance. <laughs> Carnage. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, we got it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Spare tire now on uh, BJ's Jeep. That looks pretty good, you know. Now, nah, just if we got a 35 on there, it'd match quite nice. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. I think so too. That was the easiest fix. Yeah. That went a lot easier than I thought. Well, okay then. Look at that. Um. I don't know if that's factory. 
It's aluminum. My bumper's aluminum. I'm surprised that's, it even held any weight. That's the factory part that comes off of here. You can see that it's teeth. Yeah. There's that weird line. That I don't know where. That's the other side. You can you can that, you can see that it's aluminum. That line right there is all that was holding that frontwards of everything. Oh yeah. You could yeah. Yep, it just right off. Yeah, yep, yeah, okay. Well we'll wrap it so it's not nasty friggin' Oh yeah, that's it. That's <laughs> nasty shit. Good. Okay. <laughs> Well, now I can come in from the back with, for my camera gear. <laughs> okay, well, this trail's going just... Continue on down the trail. Yeah, this, this trail's just going great. <laughs> okay. And I think it's rained more down in this valley than over by Powell where we started out. Because it is greasy and we're... We've so far ran through four big water holes or big wa uh, water mud puddles. So it's kind of washing some of the mud off. <laughs> so we'll, we'll just keep going. <laughs>
we made it long hard day of uh rallying through the mud <laughs> a lot of mud a lot of mud puddles uh, a lot of the washouts have become a lot deeper we had a lot of rain in this area so our plan is we're gonna crash here tonight uh the trail that we're on is called uh bobtail bobcat uh pass and we found this nice area that is out of the wind it's supposed to be kind of stormy tonight tomorrow's supposed to be better but it's supposed to be stormy and so we tried really really hard to find a spot that was out of the wind we aren't a hundred percent out of the wind here but it's cut down tremendously so we find a spot that was going to be pretty decent so uh we have a trailer now Yay. we started off this trip without a trailer now we have one the thing is with this trailer is we found it abandoned and uh not not like left by somebody intentionally you know they're there was no license plate the tires all had air it, it was straight up abandoned we don't know if it was stolen or not because there's no license plate and so we thought the right thing to do would to take it back to town and report it to the, the authorities so not a bad trailer it's got these really cool storage compartments on the side but not too bad. So anyways, we're setting up camp and uh, gonna start cooking up some grub. As you can see, nasty, <laughs> nasty, nasty. And a, lot, a lot of this came from just the county road <laughs> when we hit the main county road. Oh, the mud out here. It's like clay and sand mix. It's it's awful. <laughs> There's my setup. That's where I'm at. Try to get up to the rocks. It looks like uh, I'm a little not level. Still working on that. Still working on what looks level. This is uh this is fire pit for tonight. Make sure you guys stay out of the fire, okay? Acquiring some firewood. <laughs> but gorgeous valley right here. Absolutely gorgeous. Well, anyways, if you guys liked today's trip, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to hit that like button. It goes a long ways. And stay tuned because uh, tomorrow we are planning on heading out and doing some more trails tomorrow hopefully it will be nice and sunny like it's supposed to and should be a good time so thanks for coming with us we'll see you next time